We just had about a 15 minute rainstorm and as you can see the water is beading on the top it's running down it's away from the zips and uh, it's going to be a heavy one tonight and we'll see how much rain comes down we're inside the tent now it's all zipped up nice it is reasonably spacious I think three will be a slight struggle you could squeeze someone if they went down that end I think that wouldn't be so bad and um, nice little vent pouch here. Now this does open up like so to give you storage space. You can check something in there. And then uh, you zip up the fly. I suppose I'll keep the conversation flowing. And there's another vent by there. That should keep us. Uh, Pretty cosy, so we shouldn't get no wet inside it at all. We shouldn't get no condensation at all. And um, you know, your kit bag and all that, I suppose, would just be placed just outside there. If I open this side up, just to give you a little little look, you got your storage space there. As you can see, the the rain is running down the outside. So I generally just check the stuff down the bottom, out the way. Uh, we're either on the quad or in the car, so the bulk of our stuff is, is obviously stored on the vehicle. So we haven't really got to worry too much about that. But yeah, I can see having a definitely going to have a good night's sleep in this. And um, I'll give you a quick look at my boy sleeping bag. He got the Nanak and the Warlord, the Woodlow Golden Eagle. And I invested in the Alpine 600 by Rab. It's very nice down, very puffy sleeping bag, which really packs down small. Okay. I'm going to lie back now and watch a movie and give you a couple of updates as we go along. We're inside the tent and as you can hear, there's a hell of a storm brewing out there. The rain is, is really chucking it down. Um, absolute no signs of water coming in yet. It's all beaded up on the outside. Can't make me able to focus it on it. Yep, yeah, it's beaded up and it should start running away. And uh, yeah, very cosy. Um, little breeze, very, very slight breeze just coming through. And um, it's looking good. Okay, it's 12 o'clock now in, in the night and it has been absolutely hammering down the rain now for at least five hours and uh, I've read a book, done the usual and I'm ready to go to sleep. My boy is here now. No signs of any water whatsoever. A little bit there. Is off me, but as you can see, it's just like where I opened the door. It's just bobbles. There's no pools. It's a bloody slug in you. What a shit that slug in you. Cheeky bastard. Fucking pick that up walking through the grass, lad. So, yeah, it looks good. Let's see how it goes for the morning. Job done. Well, half past one in the morning now. Oh, you're taking a bit of a battering. The wind's really blowing up high. Tent is holding up very well. Brad is absolutely sleeping like a baby. Oh. He's out cold. Ah, we'll have a quick look now to see if there's any water. None of the the sheet feels wet. Put my t-shirt and my jacket down the bottom. No water on the ground sheet. 
looking good. Get on a little white bit because the water that I splashed in you when I come in, like that, but it, it obviously ain't coming from anyway. Because like when I go underneath there, there's nothing. So I think when I climbed in when it was raining, a little bit splashed in when it opened the doors. Yeah. There are a couple of drops on the inside of the outer sheet. But nothing coming in the actual tent. I'm going to sleep now, so I don't care. <sighs> Seven o'clock in the morning now, and that's all it did was hammer down all night. My boy have just got up ready for school, and Wait. Yep. Little blobbles of water. I did get up to have a wee last night. Generally, the rest of it. My clothes are down the bottom. Everything's dry. And we did have rain all night. Up the top end. Yep, everything spot on. Can't fold it. Okay, <clears throat> it's eight o'clock now. Time for me to get up. And um, we'll just have a little pier outside. Greeted by a cat, and uh, the rain have stopped. It's going to be a nice dry day now to dry out the tent, and um, job done. <laughs>